Hey everyone, I am back with some more God of War Ragnarok. About to get my ass kicked some more in this game. Thank you for being here, you amazing people, whoever you are. I appreciate you. And now, let's game. Like and subscribe. And here we are, where we left off last. Sindri's house. Such a beautiful house. Actually a pretty nice place. Right this way, Kratos. With what the hell is that? Are these mushrooms? Holy crap, that's creepy. Does he seem mad? I'm not mad, but you got mushrooms. Holy shit. They got faces. Father? Yep. Can we go yep. Sorry. Time? Sorry. I was just busy being creeped out by these mushrooms. My bad. Come in. Come in. Now, if you would just wipe your feet very thoroughly, I'll wait. Nope. You're not going to wipe your uh -uh. feet, are you? Okay, then. Your bedrooms are there. The kitchen is just over there. Any. Anybody need a snack? You're Kratos? in trouble, Sindri. Snack? I do not need a snack. What we need is your help getting to Sparto Farm so we can try and rescue Tyr. To Tyr? Al alive? I mean, that's... What? It it's okay. I told him everything. <laughs> everything. You waited my uh -oh. son disobeying me. No, I, I kept an eye on him. On your behalf. Nothing risky. Everything very safe. Somebody else speak. What's important right now is that we try and open up travel between realms again. You said you know a way? Yes, I do. I just, it's just, there's, it's just a lot of mud. Then why haven't you opened the way already, man? Well, to be frank, there was something we needed your help with. Oh, the Holder brothers finally require the services of the smartest man alive. That's it precisely. Hey, not so fast. How'd that get in here? What the hell is it anyway? That is my son. He grew up. Well, what in all yarns me the happen to him? He's too damn tall now. And he looks like that. I blame you. Now, come on then. Let's get him something that fits at least. He's just getting older, you dark prat. Didn't you ever have an awkward phase in your youth? Hey. Yeah, I suppose what's done is done. But you'll be putting your foot down from now on if you know what's good. Oh, he's trying. Believe me. All right, let's gear you fuckers up before you go off gallivant. Begin with this. Mmm. Busted up good. <laughs> Wouldn't you rather I just whip you up a new one? It is important to me. Well, I'll see what I can do. In the meanwhile, how about I fix you up with something to get you by? Yep, I would very much like that. Thank you. Welcome to the Holdra Brothers shop. Thank you. Brock has enough materials to forge a new shield. Hell yeah, we need one. Really bad. I only got materials to make one of these in the here and now. You bring me more resources, we'll see what we can do. Okay, well, we got the Dauntless Shield and the Stonewall Shield. Both of them give us plus 10 to defense. Uh, shield fit for absorbing attacks and striking back. Okay. And a shield fit for high risk, high reward parries. Let's go with that one. I like that high risk, high reward. Okay. Kratos' ability to block is restored. Now it's time to get Atreus some new armor. Hell yeah. Over there. Oh, we can, uh... 
We can do stuff for us too. Okay. If the kid's gonna insist on getting taller, best make a habit of swinging in for new duds. Nice outfit. Like it. Now my turn. Let's see what we got going on here. We have Vidar's belt of might and fortified husk girdle. Girdle. This gives us a boost to strength and defense. And that only defense. Let's go with that one. Okay. And then wrist armor. Okay. Bracers of might and husk arm guards. Again, going to go with the one that gives us both strength and defense boost. Equip it. Is that it? Weapons. Okay. Hmm. Oh yeah, because we got a frozen flame. Winner's been hard on our girl. Give her here. She's overdue for some Brock love. <laughs> Brock love. What the? What the fuck? Okay, that's it. Found some items you left behind. Tossed them in the chest. What would you do without me? I'm gonna go look around. Check out my room. Tell Sindri when you're ready. All right, have fun. I'm gonna look in this chest and see what we left. What's in here? This place is great. We got risen snow, snow breastplate. Okay. Well, that lowers our strength. Gives us more defense. Oh, and luck. Okay. Like that. Maybe we shouldn't have made we. Maybe maybe I shouldn't have made that other stuff. Oh well. More strength and luck. Now let me guess more luck. Yep. Alright. Look at us. We're pretty. Um, Brock, can I get a refund on previous purchases? Please. And how's life been treating everyone's favorite as your Vulgarian? The fuck you call me? <laughs> <laughs> Exquisite. <laughs> uh, I love rock. Let's see what we got going on around here. Got a bookshelf, little reading nook, some books, kitchen. See? I knew you wanted a snack. Freaky ass <laughs> mushrooms right out the window. Yep, no thank you. Nice little table there. Hey, come see. Hold on, we'll look at my room first. Okay. Not bad. Dad's got his own room now. I guess this is where they store the food. Nice to have options if I wake up hungry. Yeah, I mean, it is a uh, food storage, but... I think it's better than the uh, other place, to be honest. All right. Is that it? Anything else? It's a picture of a boat in the middle of the, I'm assuming, sea. Okay. All right, Sindri. What do you got for me? Finding everything all right, I hope. I am. Thank you. How do we unlock the realms? We'll just need something from back at the workshop. Follow me and be sure to bring the head. The head. <laughs> so, where exactly is Tyr being held? He is imprisoned in a mine somewhere. That's all we know so far. Hmm. The realm is full of mines, you realize. You'll need help narrowing it down. Oh, you should talk to Durlin. Who's Durlin? He's a cousin of ours, sort of. Works for the city on safety issues. Should have access to all kinds of information on mines. And I know he's no friend of Odin. That's why your mother sought his help when she was trying to whip up a rebellion. Ready? A rebellion? Did you know about that? I did not. A rebel leader who knew mom. Sounds like exactly what we need. I think you missed the ta-da. Well, never mind. I'll have this oiled up in no time. 
Meet you at the gateway outside. Rebel leader? Derlin? <laughs> if that ain't giving a hound a haircut. Huh? And you, you just remember things however they pop into your being, don't you? I suppose you think Derlin's just counting the days until a couple of strays show up looking for trouble. What do you mean, Brock? Will he help us or not? No, oh, never mind. It ain't old Brock's place to cast asparagations on my relations. This smudge sponger notwithstanding. Ignoring you. Sm Fine. <laughs> Go darken Derlin's door. See for yourself how it goes. Just be warned, he's not the friendly sort of dwarf folk you're used to. He's cranky as all get out. And he talk funny, too. Sounds like a true study in contrast. God. Yeah, with your, uh, what was that he said? Smudge sponger? The fuck is that? You hear that? Yeah, it's probably those weird ass mushrooms that are living and creepy as hell. And look at them. Can we hit them? Nope. Nope. Oh well. What you looking at there? Are those some kind of dragons? They're so far, I can't tell how big they are. Can we hit them? What are you doing? I don't think they're a threat. Also, aren't you way out of range? Well, maybe I just need to aim further. Nope. Oh well. God, that is weird. Okay. We'll just need the Bifrost in the head. Brock? Do the touching. Oh, this would be the part requiring my assistance then. You said it. This device here has been crafted to your measurements. It'll help you get a better look at the problem with those Bifrost eyes of yours. So I... Do I control this thing somehow, then? Oh, no, 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 no. This is just to hold you in place while we shine this light <laughs> in your fuck? eyes. Oh, oh, no. Oh, Cynthia, stodding bastard. <laughs> oh, that is messed up. <laughs> Open. Open now. I, I was really hoping not to use the eyelid clamps. Eyelid Do clamps? <laughs> oh! That's it. That's it. Good. Now, release! Still on poison. Oh, that's our cue. Come on, hurry. I'm coming, I'm coming. Russell goes, eggs, man. What was that for? You'll see soon enough. Just oh, there. That should do it. See? No permanent damage. I'll show you permanent damage, you wee fuck. <laughs> Get us! Throw me at him. Uh, first. <laughs> Can't you take a joke, you old goat? <laughs> poor Mimir. Let's go, bud. Sorry about that. That was messed up. The Bifrost is broken. Now that we reconfigured these gateways to use Yggdrasil seeds, you won't need a travel table or a Bifrost lamp anymore. I also used it for light. Okay. Good note. I'll figure something out. But first, come on. Let me show you how it works. Wait, did you ruin our flashlight? All right, magic door. Let's see. Okay. Aim your key at the rune for Svartalfheim on the right. Then concentrate. To get to any of those realms, you'll need a seed for them. Svartalfheim. Is there uh, other areas we've gone to? For, I'm assuming it's been a long time since I played the first one so I can't remember all right mystic gateway Arvangar wetlands all right
This should take you to the wetlands outside Nidavellir City. Just make your way to the town square and ask for Durlin at the tavern. You sure they'll know him at the tavern? Durlin's always been an inveterate inebriate. I suppose he might have completely changed, but in my experience, eh. Did you want to come with us? Oh, I might drop in, but the wetlands are moist. And the Grim are everywhere. Hostile, slimy, foul-smelling creatures. But good luck! Thanks. Wait, what? I said good luck! The wetlands are moist. You do remember we don't have the Unity Stone to let us jump off, right? Of course he remembers. Right, brother? Of course I remember. Yeah, of course I do. I'm just looking around, don't worry. Are we uh going the right way? Was I supposed to go back this way? Did I just screw all this up? Is this it? No? Am I lost already? Okay. Whoa. Do you feel that? What's that lad? Anything. Everything. It's more. Well, here are the wetlands. Look at all the wetlands. The fuck is that? Can we hit it? One less. The eyes of Odin. Okay. Is Odin peeping on us? Ravens killed one of 48. Holy shit. That is a lot of ravens. What's up here? Run, birds. Careful, lad. <laughs> uh. Oh, crap. What happened? What'd you do? Why are these things so bad? The hell are these? Wretch. Ow, you little assholes. Die, all of you. More wretches on your left. Ow. No. I see we're already off to a lively start. Petraeus, you dropped your guard. I got the boat free, though. We can head through these channels when you're ready. I haven't been here but a few minutes and I'm already getting my ass kicked. Is that everything? What's the chain in the water for? That'd be a dwarven supply ferry. Said ferry appears to be missing. Huh. Okay, that looks like everything. So now it's time for a boat trip. Let us go, boy. It is now time for the father-son fishing trip you've always wanted. I still can't believe Mom led a whole rebellion here against Odin and never talked about it. The fact that it didn't go well might have come to that notion. What your mother did before we met was her business. Did you ever ask? What the? Eyes on the water. That? They are resources. No, no, no. Am I the only one that saw that? If you never asked mom about what she used to do, what did you talk about when you met? Like, did you just say, woman, guard the house. I will go to catch fish in the river. 
and then leave for five <laughs> days? No. You're yeah. both far better at fishing than I. There they are. The hell are those? Got a chest over here. And some pots. Okay, back in the boat. Let's see. See? Uh... Did you see that over there? Yes, I did. I've been seeing them this whole time. They look like, uh... I don't know what the hell they look like. Maybe they're, uh, bigger versions of the, uh... wretches we were killing. And they're gonna be really pissed at us. Because we killed the wretches. Some rawhide. Some random barrels just floating in the water holding monies. That wheel is blocking the channel. I imagine if you can turn it, we should be able to get through. Okay, so we need to turn this... Big ass will find a beach to dock at. So these are wetlands, huh? Yep. Pretty accurate. It is a bog. The smell is making my eyes burn. You know what is a fair bit more potent than when I last visited, now that you mention it. <clears throat> Looks like the path continues on the other side of that geyser. It does. Um. <laughs> if only we were in Midgard, that water would be frozen in a second. Well, I beat your hint. So suck it. an artifact from the Dwarven Resistance. Raid Mars Brassard, father of a few new artifacts you may be well set. familiar with. Okay, well, I'm not reading all that. Things left behind. Okay. And we got labors. Okay, these are just... All right. Favors... 48 ravens. That is a lot of ravens. Okay. Rock may be interested in getting these back. Better in his hands than out in the open. One of three seals destroyed. Oh, okay. It's like, uh... Like the last game. I remember that. And here's the third one. Look at that. See that? Where'd you go? All right, whatever. Nornir chest. And a apple. A dune apple. Collected, an, collected enough the dune apples. Maximum health increased. Only collected one. So our health increases for every one we collect. Dirty enough to climb? Aye. Good old dwarven craftsmanship. <laughs> Let's go. Tyr was a friend to the giants. I wonder if he and Mom ever met. If he was a part of the rebellion here. It's certainly possible. The god of war often advocated for the giants. Although I don't recall if he ever declared allegiance outright. Come on. 
There's got to be a faster way to get down there. Well, I mean, it's a zip line's right in front of us. Did you not see that? Oh crap! There they are. Yep. Oh no! 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 Get away from me! Damn it! I am asshole. Watch your left. Okay, screw it. Behind you, mother! I am not blocking. There we go. Damn it. Kiss my ass, lizard person. Is that it? Dauntless shield. Tap L1 at the last second to parry, attack, and replace them. I think I did that a couple times. Not very good at it. Here we go. Oh. Left side. Somebody behind me? No. Damn it. Well, these things are a little assholes. Oh, I'm about to die. There we go. There's more. Get over here, you little assholes. Doing good at that at all. Holy shit. Got some beast scraps. over here a chest hello chest some more forged iron Nothing over here. <clears throat> Were you just pointing where I was supposed to go? Could you at least give me a minute to look around and find things out myself? Okay, there's gotta be some way to turn the wheel up here. Man's some warning if he's about to suddenly end up snout deep in cheek. The ground. Is that an earthquake? Hmm. An occasional but not unheard of happenstance in Spartalfheim. With all the mining here, the land's bound to be a wee bit bothered. Think you can reach the wheel from here? He said snout deep in cheek. Oh my god. Oh. Ah. There we go. Oh, wow. Nice job getting it to lower exactly where we need it. I know. I'm so good at that. At least I'm good at that. Seems how I suck ass at fighting enemies. 
Okay. I was thinking, because it's so warm, maybe it's not that the cold hasn't made it here yet, but maybe it's just different in Svartalfarm? Aye, lad. Thimble Winter doesn't strike all realms quite the same way. Weird that Thimble Winter doesn't always make it winter. In Midgard it does, but as you can see, the effects here appear far more gaseous in nature. Observe the geysers. Observe the aforementioned aroma. These effects were present before in some form, but now there's new extremity to them. Okay, so Fimble Winter just makes the environment, or whatever realm you're in, more extreme, is what I'm gathering. Oh, gotta go under here. Think we can fit under that bridge? I think we can. Look at that. Okay. What is that? I think I remember these from the last game. Can't remember what they're called, though. Dew of Runic Power. I'm not going to say that first word because I will butcher the hell out of it. Slag deposits. Okay. Oh. Some more little guys and big guys. Awesome. Ow. Okay. Knock this bucket down. Take some more of uh, Odin's offerings. Oh, hey, buddy. Let's see if I can do this. There we go. Look at me. I didn't get a chance to R3 him. You don't need that money. Okay. Father. Thanks for pointing that out. There we go. Find anything good up there? I'm not telling you. You need to be uh, less nosy. All right, let's go. Hey. 
Hmm. hmm. I think we need to get that wheel moving, but the water doesn't reach. Oh, okay. I see. Can we get that? No. Maybe we need to be higher up. Okay, we froze one of those geysers. Is there another one somewhere? Oh my god, Atreus, shut up. of this realm are anything like Brock and Sindri, it's hard to imagine them siding with Odin. Well, all too often people are blinded to all but their immediate self-interest. Odin offered them safety, and defying him can be quite dangerous. Maybe they just need a couple of gods to come along and take the fight to him. Atreus, that is not why we are here. I was only joking. War is not a joke, especially where gods are concerned. Yeah, war is not funny. Okay. There's a chest up there. It seems, Atreus, you intend to recruit Tyr as an ally for war. I just... I'm trying to keep our options open. Let's just keep moving. I'm glad we're out here, exploring a new realm. Maybe we could just try to enjoy the warmth? The hell's that? Actually, is there a way to get over there? Nope. Maybe over this way? Looks like we gotta find a way to open that gate if we want to get to Nidavolir. Okay.
What are you? Yeah. That's what I thought. Did I just crush something? Uh. Brother, look. That strange bugger popped back out of the ground again. Too fast. Then how shall we catch it? Flank it. Attack from behind. Good. <laughs> Go! <laughs> you did it. Ormir. Let's see what it dropped. <laughs> and what did you drop? Shattered rune. Rawhide. Forged iron. And health. Oh, and some slag deposits. So, basically lizard shit. Father, uh, up there. Okay. Halfway there. There's got to be another chain to lower the rest of the gate. Yeah, there probably is. In fact, it's right there. Hack silver. What else we got? Oh. Yeah, you try to. Where's my. Oh, you trying to spit stuff at me. Damn it. I'm missing all of those. There we go. All right. Think you can uncover that geyser from here? Probably. Like that? We need to, uh... Yep. Oh, I think I get it. If you freeze the geyser, the pressure will turn the wheel. <laughs> Do you get it after it's already done? <laughs> oh my god. Okay. Can we not... We need, to, we need to think be back over on this side. Maybe. Lock's coming down. Look, there's a chain we can pull up there. Is there something else we can hit? Can we hit that? Nope. Well, that turns the wheel. Maybe you could try hitting the rope holding the block.
Guess we need to. Uh... Maybe you could try hitting the rope holding the block. Nice one. There we go. Can you see anything from that block? That's one of Cavassier's poems. Very highbrow. You should collect any others you find. Will do. Another chest. Glad. If I may, what exactly are you hoping to learn from Tia? Well, like I said, I was hoping he could tell me something about Loki. I'd also like to hear some of his stories. Traveling to other lands, giant stuff, and maybe about what it was like to fight back in the day. Just for the history, obviously. History. Let's hope Tia's in a talkative mood after being imprisoned for so long. Not all of Odin's captives can be as charmingly voluble as myself. We have no proof Tyr is truly here. Right. Okay. Oh, barrel. Hold on. There we go. That earthquake earlier. Do you think there will be another one? It's unlikely, but geological disturbances tend to be unpredictable. If the geysers and smell here are worse because of Fimble Winter, maybe the earthquakes are too? Aye. You might be onto something, lad. All right. Ooh. Atreus, look ahead. Wow, now this looks like a city. Welcome to neither of you, brothers. A town? Hell yeah. Hey, dwarves! Oh. They're, uh, running away. Uh-oh. From us or, uh, something else? sound an alarm like that if I still had my body and was fearing the notion of being detached from it. Why all that for us, though? They are scared. I got a feeling that it doesn't have anything to do with us. Most definitely an alarm, I'm afraid. Why is everybody hiding? Stay alert. I got a bad feeling about this. Hey guys, uh, what are you running from? Okay, we're gonna end it right here before we get into this town and find out what the hell the alarm's about. I'm enjoying the hell out of this, even getting my uh, ass kicked. It's very enjoyable. So, <laughs> until next time, bye.